Welcome everyone to a game people have been asking me to play for a very long time, and that's Shadow Hearts from the New World. This is the fourth and last installment into the Shadow Hearts series. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to show anything else, so I'll just talk while this is going, and then if it's going to show the same thing, I'll, I'll get out of it. Anyway, uh, this is the last Shadow Hearts game, and it is my least favorite. Um, this is a very different game from the ones that we played. I'm playing this right after Kodalka. Kodalka is the beginning of the series. Okay, it is just the same thing. We don't need to see it again. Kodalka is the beginning of the series, and obviously it had a much dark... I'm just going to pour open the options so it doesn't do that. Um, Kodalka was very, very dark. And, and then we go to Shadow Hearts, which is dark with humor. And then we go to Shadow Hearts Covenant, which is has a little bit of darkness and a lot more humor. This just pretty much gets rid of the darkness entirely and focuses on the humor side of Shadow Hearts. And I mean, there's a little bit of a dark atmosphere to it, but not the way that it was in the other games. I had played this before, but I cheated when I played it because I just wanted to play through and see the story. So I ended up using my Game Shark and just made it so I couldn't die. So I could just play through and watch the story. Um, I've never gotten the good ending. I don't even know how to get the good ending. So I'm not sure if, if I'm going to be showing off all the endings like I usually do with these kind of games or not. But we'll wait and see. We're just going to see how this goes because oh, I want to turn vibration off. Hell no. I hate having vibration on. So we'll just have to wait and see. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this. And uh, just a forewarning uh, since... To me, this is what killed the Shadow Hearts series. This is where, like I said, they went completely away from the darkness that I loved about the first games. So I'm not a big fan of this game, so I am probably going to complain about certain things, just for warning, just like when I warned about not liking Karen. Uh, there's going to be bitching and griping from me about certain things. Um, yeah. To me, this game even looks worse than Covenant does. Alright, well, like I said, I haven't played- this is on the PlayStation 3. I've never played it on the PlayStation 3, so I don't have any saves, so we're starting from scratch. New game! I lost my memory that day, along with my family. When I woke up in the hospital, the doctor told me that we'd been involved in an accident. My father and sister died. Trapped in a blaze of burning crimson. If I try and remember anything else, it's terrifying. I'm trying to make it dark and scary. It's not. <laughs> I do like the theme, like the Shadow Hearts music and the intro thing we just saw. I really like I really like that theme. With the new spin on the music. This is the first Shadow Hearts game where Yuri is not the main protagonist. And uh, there's something that they do which is annoying in general. Shadow Hearts likes to try and trick you. Just like when Covenant first came out and they were like, Oh! Yuri's not in it! And then I was like, oh wait, into the trailer, he is in there. I'll point that out what I'm talking about when we get to it. I don't remember these long ass credits. Manuscript.
And if you hadn't guessed from the title, this takes place in the in uh, North America, the United States, from the New World. This game also has the Judgment, judgment Ring, like the other two Shadow Hearts games. Uh, there are some added features, but I don't remember. It's been so long since I played this. This girl here is a Harmonixer, like Yuri, and she can turn into demons, but of course when she turns into demons she has to get naked to do so for some reason. Makes sense, I guess. You know, sex sells, why not? But why Yuri? Yuri never had to get naked. That seems unfair. I wouldn't have mind seeing Yuri naked. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sad. Yeah. But you don't actually ever see anything, it's just like, jeez. Uh, her underwear stayed on. And the other one, it showed the underwear coming off. long intro for this game. Goodness. Previously, I'm Shadow Hearts from New World. I hate this music, you know. His hair bothers me. Hey, He's sticking up. Where have you been? There's work to do, Master. You've got a customer waiting. Yeah? A customer? Really? Welcome to Garland's Detective Agency. I'm the boss, Johnny Garland. Yes, how do you do? My name is Gilbert, and I'm a teaching professor from a well-known university in Boston. Huh. I wonder where that could be. Sit down. I was told by a reliable source that this is the place to come if you happen to be looking to find someone. You're looking for someone? Yes, this man. I've heard rumors that someone who looks very much like him has been seen around Manhattan recently. Marlo Brown. He's a man facing charges on at least eight counts of attempted murder, disorderly conduct, etc., etc. He was released on parole three days ago and right off the bat escaped without paying any bail money. My God, he sounds like trouble. I don't get it. What do you want a guy like that for, anyway, huh? <laughs> Let's just say we have a business relationship. He got out on bail, as you know, but I am his bond guarantor. You see, if I don't find him, and fast, I'm going to be stuck with coming up with every cent of his bail money. Hmm. I got it. I'll help you. You'll see. He's as good as in your hands. It's like stretched weird on the thing. Let's see if I can fix that. I wonder if this guy's evil. He looks like he's probably evil. I mean, you can't really judge from their appearances, but he just looks like he's gonna be a bad guy. Sure? Accepting such a dangerous case like that? What are you talking about? We just got our first real case, you know. 
Until now, all of our jobs have been things like sweeping factory chimneys and searching for runaway cats. Nothing interesting at all. Master, think about it. Don't you think it's time to quit this? It's already been a year since you left the house and opened the agency. How's your father's business gonna succeed without you to run it? Not that again. I told you I don't want to work there anymore. If you miss it so much, why don't you go back by yourself? What are you saying? On that day, I swore I would serve you for the rest of my life. You and I are one heart, one body. I can't imagine working anywhere without you, my master. Okay, whatever. Anyway, for starters, I'm gonna ask some questions. Take care of things while I'm gone. Hey, wait a minute! At least let me... come with you. I sure hope young master's going to be alright out there on his own. You don't recognize him. That's Lenny from Shadow Hearts Covenant. He's a good guy now and apparently is working for Johnny. Save point! This blue circle on the sub-map is called a save point. If you open the command menu from the save point and select data, then save. You can save your game data. Really? Wow. You go to data, you hit save, and then you can save your data? Oh my god. Judgment ring. I think I remember correctly when I started playing Shadow Hearts Covenant right after Shadow Hearts, is that the judgment ring was actually. Whoa, that is a huge ash question mark over my head. A judgment ring moves faster in Covenant, I think. Or no, it moves slower in Covenant. It's been a while since I've played any, so I won't notice. This game itself is just so much brighter. Like, I, I, guess I, I just feel like the graphics in this are worse than Covenant. Master, don't overstrain yourself. Can I change that? Oh, because I paused for a second. I was like, where did the sound go? Give me instant filter. Turns on screen filter. Oh. What the? So it's battle fusion effect. Oh, okay. So you, I was wondering if you could change the fusions. Unless the subtitles are off. I wonder if this is like Shadow Hearts as well, where. Um. Like sometimes the subtitles don't match. Oh. oh, okay. It just froze. <laughs> Okie dokie. Let's try this again. Good thing I just saved. Isn't that good? This was, I think it was used when I got it. But, I mean, I, I hardly played it. I played fine last time. Oh, my recording stopped. What the hell is going on? Okay, let's see if uh, we can get this to not freeze this time. I don't even know if I should go in here. Just grab the treasure chest and get out of here. This doesn't seem promising. <laughs> Hopefully... I don't know why they, this could be all scratched up. 
Okay. Um, it just does not want us to play this game. All right, we're going to try one last time. I'm just not going to go in there. Oh, should I quit out of it instead of resetting it? Awesome. So, the Shadow Hearts game knows I don't like it, I guess. I had no issues when I played it before. I've had it for a number of years, but I mean, it's never froze before. I wonder if I've played on the PlayStation 2. I'll have to look at it and see if it's scratched up or anything. Maybe I'll record Resident Evil tonight instead. <laughs> the fails. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Yep. Okay, yep, we can't play this game. <laughs> oh, wow. 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 I'm not going to hook up the PlayStation 2 tonight, so... Welcome everyone to From the New World. Um, shit. I was actually kind of looking forward to doing this, too. Oh! Oh, it, I thought it fixed. Let's give it a second. Is the music still playing in the background? Like half of the music? That's strange. It's like the background car noise is really here. The save point's moving. But Johnny's like stuck in, in like it's his movement, but he's not moving. Okay. Just let me move now. I broke it. Too too funny. Too too funny. I'll have to look up and see if I can get like a new copy of this off Amazon or something. Well, that's from the new world, guys. I told you it was a fail game. And it is literally failing. So I'll see you guys next time with probably not from the new world. <laughs> oh man.